Hey friends, Melinda here. Welcome to my YouTube channel where I post effective workouts so we can sweat, sculpt, burn, and transform together. If you're new here, make sure that you consider subscribing. I'm super excited to bring you one of the live classes that I hosted on Zoom. Today's class is a compilation of elements taken from my Summer Strong program, which is a high energy, low impact strength training hit program. We'll focus on building total body strength and endurance. For our equipment today, I will be using a set of threes, fives, and eight pound dumbbells, as well as a mat. Use weights that challenge you, but don't go too heavy where you're not able to maintain proper form. Now let's get ready to bring the power. All right, guys, so let's start off in a parallel position. We're going to begin to roll those shoulders up and back. So we lift and press. Now let's take it to the front. Take it four, three, and two. Last one, alternate it right to left. From here, go right to left. So we're taking a nice big shoulder roll in four, three, two. From here, circle it out. Circle, press. So big, nice. Big circle, you've got four, three. Now from here, little tiny pulses to the side. So you're isolating through your ribs, punch it to the side. You've got four, three. Let's circle it out other way right here. Go circle, press, circle, up and around in four, three. Give it those pulses to the side right here. So we're really energizing our warm up. We've got a total body workout coming up right here. Press it to the side, pump it four, three, Two, now press it to the front. Four, three, let's alternate it side to front. Press it, eight, seven, six, in five. You've got four, three, two, last one, squat it out. Four times, press, deep squat. Push those hips to the back. Exhale, breathe. From here, guys, let's keep those arms. Out, palms up, out. We're opening up the chest, out, press, reach. Now hold that last one. Half circle it around. So we're taking that half circle, half moon. Four, three, two, squat it out. Four times. Four, press. Big dynamic range of motion. Two, press. Now take it to a diagonal. We go diagonal, squat it out. Other way, press. Diagonal, squat it out. Press, reach. Diagonal, big squat. You've got two more like that, guys. Two more. Let's take it over to the side. Side, press, down. One more, guys. Down, press. From here, take a windmill up and around to a lunge. Hold it, pulse it down, press. We're gonna go forward to back right here. Forward to back, press it forward. Go four, three, two. Last one, I'm gonna bring my elbow to the instep. Elbow into the instep, open out and reach, again. Elbow down, so we're opening up those hips. Two more like this. Down, exhale, lift. One more, guys. Take it down. Now frame out that front foot, step it in. Flex and point. So we're flexing and pointing. Go four, three, two, last one. Hold that last one, flex your toe. Enjoy that stretch, breathe it. You've got the opposite side, guys. Runner's lunge, other way. Pulse it, pulse it down. Cool the belly in, long spine. We're going forward to back, right here, forward, back. Rock it forward and back. You've got four, three. You've got the elbow drive into the instep. Open up those hips. Elbow drive. Open, twist up that spine. Down. Exhale, use your breathing here. Take it down. Exhale, stretch one more, guys. Take it down, frame out that front foot, step it in. Flex and point, go flex, point. Flex and point, so we're just shifting that weight. Now hold that last one, half stretch. Hold and breathe. Inhale, exhale. In four, three, two, last one. Slowly roll it up. From here, guys, take a deep breath. Inhale up and exhale it out. Roll those shoulders back. Lift and press. Lift, lift. From here, guys, grab your three pound weights or your light set of weights, whatever you're using. Maybe water bottles today. So we're gonna go curl, twist, press. So I'm using that lighter set because I don't want you to get too much into your traps. So we're pivoting on that back toe. Take it into a hammer curl, pivot, 
pull the navel into the spine. I want you to think of growing tall and reaching with your torso twist, wrapping up and around. So we go up, press, in, exhale, take it up, press, reach, continue that series. Up, big twist, really reach into your diagonal. Up, press, reach, give me eight more counts. Go eight, seven, six, dynamic range of motion, press, reach, let's punch it out. So we go, punch across the body, little pop of that toe, exhale, push. Reach, four more, really drive it across, press, drop your shoulder down, in four, three, other way, cross that body, cross, so it's almost like a little bob, exhale, push, really energize, lift, give me four more like that, four, drive it across, all the way to diagonal, push, press, now let's alternate right here, we go alternate, give me a little plie, plie, push, cross, a little bit more energy behind it. Push it. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. From here, we take it into a deep squat. Palms up, tee it out. Palms are up, tee it out from the shoulders. So deep squat. Exhale, push. Deep squat. You can modify with a smaller range of motion if you need to. High on your releve. Down. The heart rate should be increasing. Down. Exhale, drop your shoulders down. Lower. Lift. Press. Take it down. Lift. Down. Lift. Give me eight more counts. Go eight, seven, six, five. You've got four, three. Go into a row. Palms up. Row. Palms up. So I'm just turning to the side so that you guys can see my form. Press. Palms up. Press. Lift. Squeeze it back. Elbows up to the ceiling. Breathe. Pull your navel to your spine. 45 degree angle. Let's pulse it. Pulse eight. Seven. You're going to go right away into a rear fly. Palms are in. Let's go. Fly it out. Press. Lift. Now you are going to combine those motions. Coming up. Combine those motions. Go row, fly, row, fly, press, take it, row, fly, press, again, pinch the elbows to the back, lift, elbows back, squeeze those rhomboids, lift, press, last one, roll those shoulders back, all right guys, so we are going into our low, impact cardio so I want you to give me high energy we're twisting we're twisting press press exhale twist 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 exhale knee drive really rinsing through your waistline exhale breathe twist twist so your hips are staying forward but you're rinsing through that waist press drive your knee in as much as you can Now just that single knee, I want all of your weight on this standing leg. Push, light toe tip on that opposite side, bring it out. Exhale, draw your elbow into your knee. We've got a tempo twist coming up, let's go. Pick it up guys, push, lift, you've got this. Drive it in, this is that cardio portion, let's get it up. Go eight, seven, push, you've got the opposite side, twist. Slowly, slow it down, let's go. Hips are forward towards me. Twist, knee drive, exhale. So you want to make the most of these exercises. Twist, 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 breathe. Twist, twist. So you should start to feel those abs awaken. Reach, press, twist, twist. Hips are still. Rinse it out. Drive that knee in. Exhale, press, twist. Twist, twist, now single, reach, push. Can you get that elbow a little bit tighter into the chest? Yes, you can. Go four, press, three. You've got that tempo coming up. Let's go, tempo, drive it in. Stay low on your bottom leg, bend it deeper. Drive it in further. Press, more counts like this. Go eight, more intensity, 
burn it out. Go forward, you've got a lunge, rear lunge coming up. Let's go into a rear lunge. And then you're gonna take it into a twist. Front out of two, twist leg. Four, three, go. Down, whatever leg, it doesn't matter. Press, down, press, press. Take it down, press. Take it down, can you slice? A little further, breathe. Four, you've got the opposite side. I'm going right into that opposite side. Lunge back, let's go. Lunge back, big lunge. Make it a big range of motion, or you modify today. Take it down, exhale, breathe. Heart rate should be up. Rest, eight more count. Proceed, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, come to center. Proceed, eight, seven, maybe lift up onto those toes. Up, press, in four, three, two, last one. Take a breath, inhale, up. Exhale, breathe, take it up. And press, one more like that. Lift and press. Grab your five pound weights, guys. Five pound weights. Working the lower body. Woo! Heart rate should be up, guys. Take it down for two. Let's go. Down. Second position plie. Now, your weights, they can be at the crease of your hips or they can be loaded at your shoulders. Down. Squeeze, press. Take it down. So nice and slow, nice and juicy movements right here. I want you to engage those inner thighs. So we're mixing strength training with that low impact intensity or high intensity cardio breath. Down. Singles. Let's go. Take it down. Squeeze. Again, weights can be here if you prefer. It's all about preference. Correct. Give a little bit more work to those arms. Go four. Chest is tall, back against the imaginary wall. Push those knees back. Stay with me. A little baby pulse, work those legs. Fatigue, breathe. Down, down. You're gonna rotate those toes forward, guys. You've got to squat, palms by your side. Let's go. Down, squeeze the glute. I want you to get low for me. Press, take it down. Squeeze, down. Four more. Go four. And three, we're gonna bring those legs together, all the way together. You're gonna go a little bit deeper with that squat, a little bit deeper. So we take it down, squeeze, down, squeeze and lift. Take it down, keep it going, breathe. Now baby, pulse it, right here. Pulse it eight, micro movements, get low. Chest up, press, you've got a side leg lift. Coming up, we work that leg to the side, we lift. Now guys, you can hover your leg, the entire time. Or you can tap it down to modify today. Your shoelaces, your thighs, forward. Maybe you add a lift here, press, lift. Do what you can, hold it, give me pulses. Point your toe away, point it, lift. Squeeze your navel to your spine, really reach it. Now flex your foot, flex it. Woo, breathe, press, lift, lift. In four. Three, other way, lift that leg immediately. Go up, maybe it taps. Maybe it hovers for an advancement. Hip is down, don't hike it. Maybe you add your opposite arm. Breathe. Work at your challenge level. You know where that is. Lift, hold it, go, pump. Lift, lift, point your toe away. Lift up and out of your hip, press. Now flex that foot. Press it eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, last one. Release it down. All right, low impact hit training coming up. All right, guys, so we've got two punches and then a step to the side. Let's pick it up. Other way. Two punches. Now step side. Out. Other way. Let's go. Push. Press. Now this is your modification today. Modification is to stay right here. Now if you want, you can start to add some jacks into it. So maybe you add that jack. 
push, push, out, out, push. Maybe you add a little bit more of that impact. Out, out, push, press, take it out. Out, reach, press, out, out, press. Eight more counts. Press it. Eight, seven, six, in five. We're going to go into a modified verb. Modified. We go up, center, find your plank. Push up, down, bring it back in. Give me a squat. Repeat it. Take it up, center, find your plank. Hold. Take it to a push up. Back to center. Two more, just like that. You got it. Take it up, take it center. Hold and breathe. Take it to a push up. Down, bring it back in. You've got one more like that. Take it up, center, hold, press, down, press. Give me that squat. Now from here, moving on. Take it into a knee lift. And then we're gonna hold, breathe, arabesque. Four, pull, three, repeat it. Knee comes in. Up and press. Squeeze the arabesque to the back. Squeeze that barrier. Four, three, you've got two more. Just like that. I hope sweat is dripping off your body. Just like me. Press. In four, three. Let's take it to the opposite side, guys. We lift. Center. Out. Press. Push up. Press. Squat it. Again. Take it up. Center. Out. Push up. Press. Lift. Breathe. Two more. Take it a lift. Center. Reach. Push up. Reach. Lengthen. You've got one more. Take it up. Out. Press. Push up. Press. Lift. Lengthen. Knee drive pulls in. Take it up. Take it out. Press. Pulse it. Go four. Three. Two. Take it up. Center. Flex it behind you. Four. Three. You've got two more. Just like that. Take it up. Take it back. Squeeze it. Four. Squeeze that barrier. You've got one more. Make it count. Take it up. Squeeze the needle to the spine. Hold it. Four. Three. Two. Last one. Center. Inhale. Exhale. Let's go a little bit further. Take it down. Push and press. Now you can stay here or add a hop. Go down, exhale, and hop. Go down, exhale, and push. Go down, exhale, or you stay with that previous version. Press. Last one. And breathe. Inhale. Grab your heavier set. I'm going to my eight pounds. Woo! Sweaty. Hammer curl. Breathe. Lift. Press. Take it up. Sweat in my eyes. Take it down. <laughs> and press. Take it lift. Elbows are drawing in. So I've got my eight pounds with me. Alternated singles right to left. Take it right. Take it left. Take it lift. And press. Give me eight more. Press eight, eight. Seven. Six. Five. You've got a side bicep curl. Slowly take it up. Take it up. Take it down. Breathe it up. Elbows are tight into that body. Take it up. Squeeze. Breathe. Press. Take it up. Alternated singles. Now you can go a little bit slower. Or you can take it up. If you have lighter weights, you go quicker. Whatever your body calls for. We are all different. We're on different paths. Do you today. Both arms. Press eight. eight. Seven. Six. Five, two more like that. Two, we're gonna go into a hammer curl, overhead press coming up right here. Hammer curl, squeeze overhead, lift, take it down. Now singles right to left. Go up, press, reach, take it up, press, kind of reach. So I want you to curl it in, curl, drive it up, exhale, take it lift, press. Four more like that. Four. Two more. Two. Press. Last one. 
just like that. From here, we go into Arnold presses. So my palms go forward, and then they reach. I'm gonna turn to the side so that you see me. Palms go in, palms go out. Palms go in, palms go out. So control those weights. Resist on the way up and all the way down. Down. Exhale, rest. Down. Now we're gonna single it out right here. Down and rest. Down. Push. You can slow these down if you've got heavier weights. Down. Push. Down. Push. Down. Press. Give me eight more counts. Press eight. eight. Seven. Six. In five. Go four. Three. Two. We've got a lunge sequence right here. We're gonna take it into a front lunge. Pull the knee up. Take it to the back. Maybe you step in. Here's the challenge. Maybe you take the leg up the entire time so you never set it down in between. Take it down. Exhale, knee comes up. So you're challenging that core stability. You're challenging your balance. You're focused on one point. Find a focal point and stay with it. Give me a deeper lunge if you can. Step and strike with your heel. Up and press. Take it down. Exhale, lift. Take it down. Exhale, lift. Take it down. You've got eight more counts just like that. Take it eight. Seven. Six. In five. You've got the opposite side coming up. Breathe. Take it down. Send your other way. Big lunge. Take it down. Hold in balance. Get that core involved. Breathe. Our core is so vital in our balance vital to everything that we do throughout our day, throughout all of our exercises. Maybe you're tapping down in between for that modification. Breathe. Take it down. Can you step a little bit further? I know you can. Muster up that strength. Let's go. Take it down. Squeeze and lift. Take it down. And lift. Eight more counts. Press it. Eight. Seven. Six. Five, four, three, stand to the front, triple plus squat. Take it down, down, down. Now strong, engage your glutes. Go again. Down, 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 down. Two more. Down, down, pulse. Down, engage. One more. Press it. Eight. Six, five, four, three. Bring those legs together. We've got triceps up. So bring those legs together like you're shaving behind your head. Tricep and press. Down. Exhale. Down. Exhale. You've got two more. Two. Exhale. One last one. From here, guys, gently release. We are going to our floor work. So you are going to grab your mat, open it out, get a sip of water. You are going to need your heavy weight, one of your heavy weights, guys, and a set of three pounds for your light weight. So what you need is one heavy weight and a set of your light poundage. I'm going to dry off because I'm sweating like a maniac. Is everyone doing okay? We're doing okay? All right, guys, so we are taking it to the next segment. I'm gonna show you this plank. We're gonna go down dog, center. I'm gonna take an up dog. Now, come with me. Let's go. Take it down dog. Find your plank, upwards facing dog. Don't dip in your shoulders, lift out. Pull the belly in. Take it down dog. Find your center. Find your up dog. Pull the navel in. You've got two more. Make it count. Take it down dog. Find your center. Upward facing. And breathe. Take it down dog. Find your center. Upward facing dog. I'm going to go into a kneeling position. I'm going to grab that heavy weight. Maybe double up your mat guys. So if you have weak knees, you can do the standing. Or you can double up your mat to give you extra padding. I want you to squeeze down. Now you've got those singles, kneeling singles. Take it down, squeeze and lift. Lower, squeeze and press. 
energy to drive those hips forward. Energize those heels to high energy. Four, three, two. You're gonna pulse it down in that low range of motion. Go down, squeeze down. I want you to engage those cheeks, guys. Go four, go three. Stay low for me. Sway those hips as big as you can. Sway it, sway it, side, side, side. Go four, three, two, last one. We're gonna go into a kneeling position, guys. Step that leg forward. We're going right into a row right here. Lift and press. Go four, three. You've got a kick back coming up in four, three. We row, kick back. Row, kick back, press. Row, kick back, press. Is anyone else dripping sweat? I am, exhale and press. Take it up, press. Now we go tricep, we kick it. And I do not want you to open up your shoulder, guys. Both shoulders are pressing down into your mat. Square off those hips, you've got four more. Go forward, get that tricep engagement. Squeeze two more, two. Listen up, guys, you gently drop that heavy weight down. Sweep your leg around, quad your head. Take it down into your form. We're gonna lift that back leg up. So it's a high arabesque. And press. Squeeze and lift, engage your derriere. I don't want to see this, so I don't want you arching in your back. I want you to pull your navel to your spine. Lift and control. Press. Take it up. Down. Squeeze. Singles. Let's go. Take it. Squeeze the glute. Lift up and out of your shoulder joints. You don't slump in those shoulders. Lift three, four more like that. Four. Three. Squeeze it at the top. Engage. Press. Hold it. Micro pulse. Pulse. This is a gentle externally rotated leg. So you've got a slight externally rotated leg. Flex your foot for me. Go. Press it eight. Squeeze it harder like you need it. Press it. Go four. Three. Two. Last one. Gently lean back. Take a breath. I can't stop sweating. Take a breath. Inhale. All right, guys. Grab your heavy weight. Take it to the back of your knee. You can do this without or lighter weight. From here, I'm going to come down to that opposite forearm. I'm going to begin to lift that leg. So now, I'm really firing up my hamstring. Glute is working as well, but the hamstring is getting a lot of work here. Press. So my opposite forearm is down on the ground. Press. Lift. Strike it up. Like you're going to poke a hole in the ceiling. Take it up. And press. Now give me baby pulses. Let's hit it out. Go pulse and pulse. Again, like you are driving a hole into that ceiling. Press. Give me eight more counts like that. Press it eight. That hamstring, if you're doing it correctly, the hamstring should be on fire. Go four. Three. Now we're going to go into a pretzel, guys. You hook behind the stand or the kneeling knee. Take it cross behind you. Pretzel it behind. Now you've got a combo. Pull knee to knee. Knee to knee. Now pretzel behind that kneeling knee. Press. Now we're firing up those glutes. Hamstring as well. Press. Go four. Three. Two. Last one. Gently set that weight to the side, guys. We're going right away to an elbow plank. Hold your elbow plank and breathe. You've got a side step, right to left slowly to modify. Here we go. Take it right. Center. Out. Now you can stay with this, guys, or you can stay with the plank, or you pick it up. Let's pick it up. Let's go. Push it eight, seven, six, and five. Go four and three. Booties down. Now hold that plank. Hold it. Zipper up that core. Give me one straight line from the tip of the head all the way to those heels. Go four, three. Coming to a side kneeling position. Drop those knees. Grab your light weight right here. We take it to a little bob mob forward. Now, if this is too much intensity on your shoulder joint, do it without it. Squeeze. Press. Now lengthen. You can always make a fist on this stabilizing arm. And squeeze. Four more. Engage. Press. It's working mobility here. Strength. In four. Three. Go right to the side. Punch it up. So 
you lift. Or if this is too much, place your hand on your hip. Absolutely fine. Lift. Press. Stay with me. You got it. Strong body through here. Press. Lift. Press. Thighs forward for me. Press. Three pulses to finish up. Pulse in eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Last one, guys. Move your weights to the opposite side. So it's a pretty quick transition. We've got the opposite side, guys, to do. So we've got that down dog, center, upwards facing dog. Lift through your chest, pull the belly in. So I want you to think of really pulling that belly into the spine. Open up, do not collapse in those shoulders. Keep your energy. So the energy that you started class with, I want that energy right here. Take it down. Center, lift it down. We've got that kneeling position. Grab your heavy weight, guys. Kneeling position, down for two counts. Remember, double up your mat with your sensitive knees. It's okay to do what works with your body. Like I said, you do you today. Make it count. Make it happen. Singles. Down. Squeeze those cheeks, guys. Large range of motion here. Engaging that derriere. Four more. Go four. And three. And two. Now let's hold it down. Little micro pulse. Down at the bottom. Half range, guys. Lift and lift. You've got those big hip sways. Let's see you sassy hips. Side to side. Side, side, side. Rest side. Go four, three, right into that kneeling row. Step into that kneeling row. Row it, exhale, press, lift. So we're not gonna open up here. I'm going to stay nice and square to that mat. It's a big range of motion. You've got that combo kick back. Let's go. Take it up, kick back, squeeze, press, up. Elbow goes high. I want you to feel that engagement. Breathe, press, lift, squeeze. Now from here, just reach and press. Lift, press, lift. Extend elbow high up to that ceiling. Keep it going. Four more just like that. Four, and three. We've got that quadruped position coming up. Gently lower that weight down. Place those palms, swing it around. We've got the forearm down. We're lifting up for two. So I've got that opposite. Again, you've got to put your mind into the muscle that we're working in. That is that barrier right here. Singles, let's go. Take it up. Your thigh is slightly out to the side. So slightly out with that extra rotated position. If you're not feeling that glute, you've got to try a little bit harder. In four, three, hold it, give me that pulse. Pulse and press, micro pulse. Pull the belly in, push the floor away. And exhale. All right, guys. So grab your heavy weight. Place it behind the back of that knee. We're going to begin to lift lower. So opposite forearm down. We've got that heavy weight behind the back of the knee. If you're wearing shorts, you can always place a towel underneath that weight. So it gives you a little bit extra cushion. Lift. Press. Lift. And press. Go four. Three. Give me that pulse right here. Let's pulse and press. Again, we're activating your hamstring. You're pointing your toe up to that ceiling. Press. Give me eight more counts like this. It's firing. Lift. It should be burning. Press. You've got that pretzel coming up. Pretzel. Here we go. Take it across. Lift. What I mean by pretzel is that we're working that working knee behind that stabilizing knee. Well, let's combo it out. Take it down. Press it out. Squeeze. Take it down. Knee to knee. Knee to knee. Press. Hook it behind. Breathe. Lift. Press. Hook. Press. Down. Press. Give me eight more 
one count right here. Press the eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Last one, elbow plank right into it, guys. Try not to think about it, just get into it. Breathe, press. For four, you've got those slow side steps. One straight line, let's go, tap it out. Out, in, take it out, take it in. You can stay with this, guys, or let's pick it up to tempo. Let's go, take it out, and out, and out. Press, booty down, go four. Go three and two. Give me the best plank. This is that last plank of our workout. So you strong. Line in four, three, two. Come to that kneeling position. Grab that light weight. We've got that bottom up press. Squeeze up and out. So don't sink in the shoulder. Get up and out of that shoulder press. We squeeze bottom up. Woo. Press it out. Take it late and press. Give me eight more jumps like this. Go eight, seven, six, in five, in four, and three. Straight up to that side body. Take it late. Now that thigh is forward. Chin is forward for me. Point your toe like I'm stretching it away from your body. Four more. Go four. You get what? You get what you put into your workout. So make an effort right here. Hold it. Let's pulse it. Pulse it eight, seven, six, five. Lengthen four, three, two. Last one from there, guys. Okay, we're moving to our core section. So from here, grab your light set of weights. I've got my three pounders. Sink it to a C curve. From here, I'm going to row the outside arm. So my opposite arm is at 90. Find your C curve. Scoop the belly and flex through your toe tips. Lift and press four more like this. Four, exhale. So you're flexing at your toe tips so that you're alleviating pressure out of those hips. Breathe. From here we twist and rinse it. Twist, side to side. Rinse it out. So I want you to think, like your waist is a washcloth. Eight more counting, you're wringing out the midsection. Press. Now you've got the opposite row coming up. Try to tap those elbows down. Breathe. Press. Now let's hit it right your other way. Take it up. Exhale. So now I'm rowing the opposite arm, pinching the elbow down into the ground. Squeeze your navel in to the spine. Breathe it out. Use that breathing. Four. Press. Three. Exhale. Two more like that. Two. Press. Last one. Hold. Rinse and twist right here. Can you get a little bit deeper in your C curve? Challenge your body a little bit deeper. Press. And reach. Give me eight more counts right here. Press it. Eight. Seven. And six, dig a little deeper. Go four, and three, and two. From here, give your hips a little stretch. Breathe, inhale, exhale, slowly come down. Flex your feet, weighted crunch, take it up. And we slowly come down. And press, we take it up. Press, down. So these are slow and controlled. Exhale. Press, slowly take it down. So these are very slow. You don't want to use momentum to get yourself up. You want to use that core musculature. Rely on those muscles, not momentum. Press, take it down and press. Exhale and lift and press. Now from here, slowly come down. Take one of your weights down. Place your left hand behind the nape of the neck and we're to crunch up from here. Exhale. So we crunch through the center, press, exhale. So I'm crunching right through the center of those legs. Take it up, take it down, exhale. We lift and lower. Now your elbow, it is wide. Don't pull it in, open it up. Exhale, get that form on point. Hold it, pulse it, pulse it, eight. Now, no yanking on that neck. Again, use that core 
Go four and three and two. Other way, right here, we crunch. So now my opposite palm is behind the nape of the neck, giving it some support. Exhale at the exertion point, which is going to be that top range of motion. Lift. Four more just like that. Exhale, breathe. Press. Lift. Two more just like that. Exhale and press. Breathe. Lift. Now hold and pulse it out. Pulse it eight. Seven, six, in five, go four, three, two. From here, we're going to extend those legs to a little V to the edges of the mat. I'm gonna take the weight across the body and press. So I'm reaching with opposition, push. So I'm punching across, elbow drives down to the earth. Push and press, exhale. Give me four more just like that. Four. And press. Three. And press. Two more. Go two. And press. Last one. Take it to the opposite side right here. Go reach. And press. Exhale. Lift. Squeeze. So I'm coming across the body. Pop, pop, stretch. Nice and control. No flailing legs. Four more. We go four. Press, anchor those hips, reach. Two more like that, two, press. Last one from here, gently set that weight down, guys. Bring those knees in, you've got four bicycles and four scissors. Four, three, bicycle it out. Press, four, three, and two. Now four scissors, go, press six, four, and three. And two, stay with me. Bicycle press, go four, and three, and two. Press scissor four times, go four. Connect that elbow to the midline. Press, and reach again. Four, three, two. Scissors to finish off that core, guys. Let's go. Pick up that tempo, maybe. Reach and press for eight, seven, Six, five, finish strong. Four, three, two, last one. Cool the knees in, give them a hug. You made it to the cool down. Don't forget about the cool down, guys. Stay with me, stay right here. Now from here, guys, I want you to just circle those knees up and around, giving your body some love here. We took it through a lot. Now it's time to enjoy those stretches. And then from here, guys, I want you to take the leg and cross it up and over, spinal stretch. You can always unhook the legs if that feels uncomfortable in your body. You're pressing the palms down. So it's a cross leg spinal stretch here. Just allow the weight of those knees to fall down into the earth, holding here for four, three, Two. Now pull the belly in, guys. You've got the opposite side. Unravel those legs, hook it, and gently allow those legs to fall to the side. Make sure the weights are out of the way here. Breathe. Taking those nice long stretches. Stretching is so important at the beginning and end of our workouts. So making time for it here. And then very slowly use your core to lift you back up. And then from here, I want you to stretch your right leg up to the ceiling. If you need to, you can bend this bottom leg. Take a breath here. So pulling, gently feeling that nice long stretch, running up your hamstring. Maybe you flex your toe tips if that's where you need to go. Ooh, I'm pretty tight there. Maybe you are as well. And then just gently point that toe, take it to the side, anchor your hips down, open it out here for four, three, two, bring it back in through center, give it a little pull, gently lower the leg with control, you've got that opposite side, maybe the bottom leg is extended, maybe it's bent here, pull the knee in, extend it up, enjoy that stretch, this leg is much tighter for me so there's a lot of tension happening but just breathe through it so when I know that I have a tighter side I just really try to take deep inhales and long cleansing breaths out 
so that I can really release within the stretch and try to release any tension that my body is holding. Breathe. And from here, gently take it to the side, anchor your hips down, open it out to the side body. Again, continuing that breath work. Bring it a little bit closer through center here. Pull those knees in, gently rock up to a seated position. We're gonna go into a seated figure four. So I'm crossing that leg on top of the thigh. Bring that heel into your booty and now I'm going to lift up and crawl that booty closer. Open your knee up, so you're gonna sink your hips down. Open that knee nice and wide, flex through your toe tips here. Take that breath, inhale. And exhale it out, open it a little bit further, holding here for four, three, two. Last one, lower down, you've got that opposite side. Come into that figure four, lift up, open your knee nice and wide. Press that knee open as you flex through your toe tips, lift through your chest. And if you're not feeling it, open the knee further and sink the hips a little bit lower so that you can get a little bit deeper. Holding here deep in that stretch for four, three, two, last one. Taking a breath as we extend those arms and legs. Lift, inhale, thanking your body for all it just completed. One more, inhale, deep breath, and then cleansing breath out. You guys made it. Awesome work toughing it out with me today, guys. You guys rocked it. If you want to learn more about my Summer Strong program and all of the other comprehensive programs that I offer, make sure that you visit my online studio today at embodiment360.com. This is where you can check out highlights and descriptions of each and every workout. Thank you guys so much for joining me, and I can't wait to sweat it out with you guys soon again.